Well, Raymond, we're running out of time, but I can't let you go without asking you this. Uh, it's been about seven or eight months now since the United States has had an ambassador to Egypt in Egypt. Uh, do you think we'll have one soon? And what type of person should we have there? Well, we should have a person that, uh, you know, Ann Patterson, uh, who was really there during the time of Mohamed Morsi, just showed uh, unequivocally to the Egyptian public, you wouldn't see this in the Western media, but in the Arabic media and Egyptian media, it was a constant daily thing of how what she said or what she did that was so blatantly pro uh, Muslim Brotherhood. And one of the things, of course, is right up leading to the June 30 revolution. She was actually actively telling people, including specifically meeting with the Coptic Pope, saying, don't go into the revolution and don't protest, which was basically telling, especially the Copts, people who are being, uh, you know, downtrodden by Islamic Sharia, thanks to the Muslim Brotherhood, don't protest against this. And so what we need is an ambassador who can actually, uh, uh, you know, bring American interests with Egyptian interests, try to align them and find a happy medium, one that is satisfactory to all, but not one that very clearly and obviously sides with a faction that is now seen as terrorists. Okay, Raymond Ibrahim, thank you. A lot to think about, a lot to pray about, and I'm sure you'll help us stay on top of it. Thanks so much. Thank you, Gary.